is so close, man. This is... No. Not like this. Not like this. Don't do me like this, man. Do not do your boy like this. Okay, we need an additional super, man. We need, we need two supers right now. Two supers right now. If he supers me at the end, it's over. Alright, so I'm sure you guys saw the tragedy that was the end of my last attempt. Um, I don't think I've ever felt that kind of pain <laughs> when it comes to Dokkan. I mean, like, that was... I don't know, man. We were so close. He had, like, half a percent of HP left. If Vegeta had just hit a little bit harder... The SDR Vegeta, that is. If he had hit a little bit harder, or I don't know, if he just got like an additional normal attack, we would have been done. We would have been done. But you know what? <sighs> if there's one thing people can't say about me, it's that I'm a quitter. So even though I'm in a lot of pain right now, even though I want to cry, we're going to try again, and this time, we're going to win. So, uh, anyways, we are taking on the Fighting Legend Vegeta slash Legendary Vegeta event. The team is, well, technically, Mastered Evolution. That's the mission we're trying to beat. But, uh, sadly, your boy has not been able to pull the new STR Super Vegeta. So instead, we're using one friend STR Vegeta, and my Fizz... Transforming Vegeta as the other lead. The rest of the team is transforming Goku, uh, Super Saiyan 2 Vegeta, Super Saiyan 2 Angel Goku, and then the stacking Super Saiyan Blue Goku and Super Saiyan Blue Vegetas. Um, the items I did change up a little bit before I was using Princess Snake and Aider, but now we're gonna use a Whis and an Aider because I feel like we need more damage reduction instead of healing. And uh, that is the setup. Now, before we get into the gameplay, I do want to give a quick shout out to the sponsor of today's video, Gamersups. They recently released some amazing new waifu shakers, like this one right here, as well as some delicious new flavors. Like, uh, we got black cherry, and also uh, pina colada, which is one of my personal favorites. And finally, strawberry daiquiri. So make sure to head down to the link in my description, check out all their new stuff, and if you see something you like, you can use my discount code TIGER for 10% off your entire purchase. So that's Gamersups, thank you for sponsoring the channel, and uh, with that said, let's do this again. But this time's gonna be different. This time's gonna be different. That really sucked, guys. That was really, really rough, I gotta say. Alright, so um, obviously we are going to leave the phase Vegeta in rotation since he needs to stack up. Um, let me see here. If I give these to Goku, is Vegeta going to get a super? He does. Okay, we got lucky. So, uh... <sighs> here we go. Here we go. The Fizz Vegeta, unfortunately, does not have an Extreme Z Awakening yet. He would be a lot better. And I'm not saying he's bad now, right? Like, he's still decent without an EZA. He's still usable. But uh, the double STR Super Vegeta setup would have been definitely much better. Um, 
but we don't have STR Vegeta, so we gotta work with what we have. Alright, so on this rotation, I'm going to be uh, putting this guy in. I would like to keep the uh, STR Super Vegeta, but he doesn't need to stack, so for these early stages, let's just uh, keep the stackers, let them stack for as long as possible. Let's, uh, okay, so yeah, let's give these to the Fizz Goku. Let's give these to Tech Goku. Or sorry, AGL Goku. And then we still got a super for SDR Vegeta, but he's probably not gonna get to attack. Unless something crazy happens. The two Gokus should be able to take him out. There we go, okay, so both Gokus getting to stack some defense. That's exactly what we need. Now, when I started the last run, I did not expect that uh, the STR Super Vegeta would be the one to get us killed. But I also forgot that Super Saiyan Blue Evolution Vegeta is AGL, so um, he really struggles there. Let's be honest, he, he really, really struggles uh, in the later stage, I mean specifically that stage. Specifically that stage. He's good up until Super Saiyan Blue Evolution Vegeta. And then when you get to SSBE, um, he takes a lot of damage. So that's why I brought the Whis, because I feel like the Whis is going to help us much more with the 40% uh, damage reduction. It still might get us killed, you know, um, or we still might get killed uh, regardless of what item we use, just because the SSB Vegeta hits that hard. But I think having two Whises gives us a better chance to survive compared to Princess Snake. Because, like, the, the HP wasn't a huge problem, you know, like, we were healing up pretty consistently with... The uh, orb changers getting you know a ton of HP with the same type orbs. <laughs> yeah, so even even with what just happened, I'm I'm okay with our HP. I, I'm I'm fine with like being able to heal up with orbs like this, but uh, the damage reduction was definitely the bigger issue. So yeah, okay, <laughs> we got this though. <laughs> We got this though. I was a lot more confident in the last run. Um, you guys are not going to get to see it just because of how things ended. But, you know, coming in, I was like, yo, even though I don't have STR Vegeta, we got this, man. We'll be fine. You know, like, this team is still very powerful. We still got a lot of amazing, you know, units here. So, <laughs> it's not a big issue. And uh, I got humbled. I got humbled, that's for sure. I gotta start taking this event more seriously. Um, I think I didn't show it the respect that it really deserved. And uh, my punishment was, was death, you know? <laughs> my punishment <laughs> was was death, and it was not fun. All right, uh, let's put the Phase Vegeta there. I'll give him these orbs so we can give the tech orbs to the tech Super Saiyan Blue Vegeta, and then uh, just in case um, we need him, he also gets a super at the end there, but we should be able to kill this Vegeta with these first two supers. There we go. Okay. I would have preferred if both Vegetas got the super, but it's not a huge deal at this point. Um, by the way, if you guys are confused about why... I'm wearing a Christmas sweater or a holiday sweater in the middle of January. It is a little bit weird, uh, but the reason, <laughs> there is a reason for it. The reason is that uh, this was supposed to be a Christmas present from Android 18, from Taya, um, you know, like two weeks ago, but there were some delays and uh, she was never able to uh, give it to me during Christmas. So it just came today. And uh, I love it, you know, I think it looks awesome, so to make her happy, I'm gonna be wearing it for the rest of the day, and then probably not too much for the rest of the year until we get to the holidays again, but this is a really sick sweater, guys. I mean, it looks like just a regular, like, Christmas sweater on top, right? But if you go down a little bit, you will notice that this is actually a Gara Christmas sweater. So you got the uh, love symbol here that he has on his head. And then we also have like some other things like uh, the Sand Village 
icon, which I'm not sure if you guys can see in this uh, webcam here, but yeah, it's there. The Sand Village, as well as a little silhouette of uh, Gara and Shukaku. We have his gourd over here, and just some other references to like the Sand Village or Gara himself. So, yeah, Gara, if you guys didn't know, is one of my favorite characters. By far, one of my favorite characters in uh, Naruto. So, I was pretty stoked to to get this sweater. And I was in a much better mood uh, before I died. But nonetheless, still still very hyped for the sweater. <laughs> still very hyped for the sweater. I'm going to be even more hyped once we finally take this event down with this team. I mean, I say finally. It's not like we've tried that many times. But... Two is still too many, man. <laughs> two attempts is still too many. It should be one attempt and done. And we, we, we should have been able to beat it in one attempt. Honestly, like, let's be real. We just got unlucky. We just got really, really unlucky with that one super. Okay. Um. Let me see here. We don't really need to do anything with this guy as far as, like, stacking defense or anything like that. So why don't we actually put the... Uh, STR Vegeta. Mm, you know what? I want to get a super off with him, so maybe I should put the Goku there, but what if Goku gets supered? That would really suck. I guess it's a risk we gotta take. Um, and then we'll give... I guess these orbs to Vegeta. And then we can still get a super off with Super Saiyan 3 Goku. Okay, so we're not getting super... 54k! Oh my god. That was a bad idea. That was a bad idea. Oh my god, mistakes were made. Guys, I messed up. I messed up bad. This is... Yo. <laughs> oh, I just wanted to give a super to the Vegeta, man. I didn't know it was going to turn out like this. We'll be fine. We'll be fine. We, we, uh, we, we got a token attack coming up. We'll heal, we'll heal back up. Uh, I'm probably not going to be popping any items until Super Saiyan God Goku. But, but, man, that was a very, very sad <laughs> turn right there. Okay, um, so obviously, we're going to give all of these orbs to Vegeta. Some nice healing done as well. And then six orbs for the tech Vegeta. Not bad. And we can't get a super off with Majin Vegeta, but it's not a big deal. As uh, we should be able to kill the, you know, Super Saiyan Vegeta. Sorry, Super Saiyan 2 Vegeta with this token attack. Hopefully. <laughs> I'm anxious, man. I should I should not be anxious this this early into the into the event, but it's just not a good day, <laughs> apparently. <laughs> There's a nice crit, thank you very much. And now we have Super Saiyan God Vegeta. Um the timing isn't great, I gotta say. The timing is not great, because um, if last turn we had been able to use that, like, full board is Vegeta attack, we might have been able to one-shot this guy. Might have been able to one-shot this guy. But hey, it's okay. It's okay. Let's give these to Goku. Uh, seven orbs for the Fizz Goku. His defense will be at... 129,000, of course, Fizz Orbs would have been a lot better, but we should still be fine either way with the type of advantage. Additional? Come on, man, I need some additionals. I need some additionals. This Goku is going to give me that additional. I can feel it. I was wrong. Alright, alright, so, uh, 
SDR Super Vegeta can use his active skill now, but I decided to save it for the next phase because um, Super Saiyan Blue Goku, or rather Super Saiyan Blue Vegeta, is Fizz. So we should be able to get a nice turn with the active skill once we get to Super Saiyan Blue Goku. Sorry, not Goku. Super Saiyan Blue Vegeta. <laughs> Super Saiyan Blue Vegeta. Um, this turn, we are... Hmm... I mean, we're not in trouble if I can give some nice tech orbs to the tech Vegeta. That's going to be 7. So, his defense is now all the way up to 190,000, which is still not great. It's not bad. It's not bad. And to be safe, I'm a Papa Whis. Yeah, because uh, a super against the tech Vegeta would be really, really bad. Or the, the Goku, actually, especially because... Um, you know, we're not getting super with him this turn. Yeah, 12k is, is okay. That's completely fine. Additional... I mean... I guess it's better than nothing, but... Have we... Have we seen one additional super? This entire run yet? I don't, I don't think we have. This entire event so far, this entire video, I don't think we've seen a single additional super attack. Which is just wild. That's just crazy. Alright, um... So with the Whis active, I really don't think, you know, anybody's a concern here. Maybe the, the Majin Vegeta, but he's even getting 6 orbs, so he's getting guard, guaranteed guard. So he should also be okay. Probably. Probably. So this one's gonna be a crit. Nice. And then Fizz Goku, 2.2. Um, additional... The RNG gods just hate me today, man. I, just, <laughs> I don't know what else to say. RNG is just not on our side today. Man, oh man. Okay, don't super, don't super. Thank you. At the very least, we didn't get supered there. Um, let me see. So, we can probably... I'm still gonna save the uh, active skill for the next phase. And I was thinking maybe we should use an item, but as long as the first attack isn't a super, we should be okay. There we go, yeah. So I was worried about that first attack because uh, that was like without the additional defense boost, but we took the first attack, 50k, it hurt. But it could have been a lot worse, and uh, now we'll finish off the Super Saiyan uh, God Goku, or sorry, Vegeta. <laughs> I'm so used to doing the legendary Goku event, that's probably why I keep calling him Goku, even though it's clearly Vegeta. Uh, Alright, so Super Saiyan 3 goes to the back. Um, Fizz Goku can actually... Hmm. Fizz Goku first slot. 195,000 defense. Uh, maybe we pop an Android 8 just for the additional defense. And then 8 orbs for the end Super Saiyan 3. Do not super me. Do not do. Thank you. Thank you. <sighs> okay. Of course, the additional is not a super. And of course, we get super now. But with the additional defense, um, this shouldn't hurt too badly. I was wrong. I was wrong. It hurt pretty bad. <laughs> and finally, an additional super. 
If AGL Goku had taken that super, we probably would have taken like 50k as opposed to 100k. But that's just how it goes, man. You know, that's just how uh, today's been. So I'm, I'm not not going to say I'm surprised by any means. Okay. So now would be a good time to pop the active skill. But you know what? I'm going to actually save it. I'm gonna save it. I'm gonna save it for uh, the the Super Saiyan Blue Evolution Vegeta. I think that's a good plan. Since we're doing well, um, at, at least pretty well <laughs> against the Super Saiyan Blue Vegeta, and the Super Saiyan Blue Evolution Vegeta actually gives us a lot more problems, you know. So might as well uh, just hold on to that active skill. And hopefully on the turn that we pop the active skill, he gives us an additional super too. So that we can do some extra damage. And uh, that would just make me feel much better. About being able to clear this here. That was good. That was great, actually. That uh, super attack could not have landed on a better option. So <laughs> yeah, good job. Good job. All right. Um, this turn, let's put uh, Fizz Goku there. Um, AGL Goku, I'm still gonna keep, and then Fizz Vegeta. Maybe I should not have left at the end. Now that I'm thinking about it, it might have been a bad move. <laughs> might have been a really bad move. <laughs> I probably should have just rotated out the uh, AGL Goku, but hey, what's done is done. What's done is done. He, he probably won't super us again this turn, right? He just super us last turn. He just super us last turn. What are the chances that he'll super us again on the on the next turn? Very low, right? Very low. Please. <laughs> Fine. It's okay. Okay, so maybe it's not the most okay. <laughs> it's not the most okay it could have been. But, uh... We made it. And that's all that matters. Okay, so now if he doesn't super us... Um... We'll make it through just fine. Yeah, I gave the uh, tech orbs to this Vegeta in the beginning just because I wanted to heal up. Um, but now that I think about it, maybe it wasn't the best idea. But we did not get punished for it. So, thank god. Okay, okay. Here we go. SSBE Vegeta now. SSBE Vegeta. Last phase. Last stage. Um. Let's see. So we put this guy there, this guy there. Uh. Ooh. Actually, can't get a super. Um. Hmm. Okay, okay, why don't we do this? Okay. And then... Okay, I'm gonna pop an Android 8. <laughs> Aider. And then we'll give one orb to the Tech Vegeta for now. So we can give seven orbs to the Fizz Goku. Yeah. Oh man, okay. Oh man, okay, all right. Uh, two, 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 you know, um. Could have been worse. Could have been worse. <laughs> At the very least, the normals are still doing double digits. That is a good sign. 
And he's taking double digits too. Great. Uh, ooh. Yo, this is fantastic. Okay, so we can put the... Is Super Saiyan Blue Vegeta at the end? Although he's taking a lot of attacks there, um, it's not an ideal situation, that's for sure. But we gotta play it like this, and then I'm going to, I guess, pop the active skill. We 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 should be taking a hit first, but uh, it, it's kind of risky. <laughs> it's too risky, so. Yeah, I'm gonna leave him in that middle slot. I'm gonna pop the active skill. Uh, definitely heal up a little bit there. And then give these two fizz. Uh, should I pop the waist right now? Should I pop the waist right now? Although I wanna save it. Screw it, let's pop the waist. Let's pop the waist. Better safe than sorry. Better safe than sorry. If he were to super the Fizz Vegeta, then um, I'll be happy that I used the waste there. Oh, of course, he supers the Tech Vegeta. All right, so this is gonna do nothing. Yeah. <laughs> There's that. There's that. Okay. And then we can save the Dokkan attack for next turn. Um, let's see. An additional super. Just pain. Just pain. What else can I say? <laughs> pain. All right. Uh, let's see. Give these to Goku. Eight orbs for Vegeta. Two for Super Saiyan three Goku. And let's get a perfect token attack. Should be some good damage. And then Vegeta I know is gonna tank very well, so I'm not really concerned about dying this turn. Um, next turn might be rough though, because uh, we're out of items. <laughs> so we'll be at full HP, we'll be at full HP. We're just out of items. And uh, if he gets super, then it's, it's over. Some additional supers would be really nice, I'm, I'm just saying. Oh my god, stop teasing me with the additional normals, man. Okay, okay. Um, let me think. So next turn we have STR Vegeta, Tech Vegeta, and Fizz Vegeta. Not the greatest lineup. <laughs> and this is also not the guy I wanted to additional Superman. I mean, it's, it's not gonna hurt. It's just other people additional supering would have been much better. Okay, um, I think it, okay. It's, it's a risk, it's a risk, right? For sure it's a risk. But I think putting STR Vegeta here makes the most sense because if it's not a super with the first hit, right? If that's not a super, then we get a lot more defense. Here we go. Let's see if they decide to screw me a second time. Let's see if they decide to screw me a second time. Uh, man, I guess I'm gonna have to do this. Ooh, I don't know, actually. Okay, so if I give these to Goku, 335,000. And that should be good defense for Vegeta. Oh my god. <laughs> Holy crap. Okay, well. The worst part is over, right? Oh, double supers. Double supers. Beautiful. I think the worst part is over, guys. Okay. Okay. Hmm. 
We're gonna do this. I, I, we're actually gonna do this. Yo. Okay. See, this is fine. This is this is actually. I mean, it's not. It's not fine, but it's not bad. It's not bad. No, it's it's not bad at all. And then this turn we put Majin Vegeta there, right? And then we uh, give a super to Goku. And the only thing I have to hope for now is that he doesn't dodge our supers. If both of those supers land, we're good to go. Okay, this the, the first one's good. First one is good. Additional. All right. Goku, don't miss. Don't let him dodge you. We're good. I think we're good. I think we got this. Ooh. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> That was still way too close, man. That that was still way too close. But I was beyond stressed, man. And and if it wasn't for the fact that the last attempt, the last run was like so rough, um, and like how it ended, I would have been so much more chill in this video, right? I would have been like so much more relaxed, but because of what happened, I just had to get this dub, man. I had to get this win and we, we got it. We got it. So there you go, guys. <laughs> that is the video. We got our stones, we got our tickets. Um, not quite enough to do a multi, but I will do another multi soon when we collect our, uh, well, the daily stones, pretty much the, uh, Login bonus stones, I should have enough with that and like the missions and stuff like that. So anyways, um, I'm going to I'm going to call it there, man. I, if I do a multi at the end of this video, it's probably going to be a shaft. So I think I've taken enough L's today. I'm going to take my win and go home. It's like uh, when you're like at the rec center, you know, you're playing basketball or whatever. Um, you want to leave on a win. You want to leave on a dub. You don't want to like have like five wins and then your last game before you go is an L like that's just gonna stick with you so we got our dub <laughs> I'm calling it a day I'm not touching Dokkan anymore until tomorrow so uh, thank you guys for watching as always if you guys liked today's video make sure to like the damn video sub to the channel if you're new hit that notification bell so that YouTube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content and that's it. I'm out of here. Have an awesome, awesome day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media. Signing out.